Hey. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Had to come get an early morning workout. So I was uh I was going through some of my inbox messages and uh a lot of people keep asking me like, bro, how you always so positive? How you stay positive? And and it's like week after week after week I keep getting these messages and I'm like, all right, I might need to to touch this topic, man. So uh I don't know, when it comes to positivity, I guess I guess one thing with me was the realization of okay, let, so let's say I had a I had some facial problems growing up that I thought was just like teenage acne. You know what I'm saying? So I go to dermatologists after dermatologists and they convincing me that oh, it's what you wash your face with. And I'm like, "Man, I think it's something I'm eating, you know? Like it just it seemed like certain food to break me out more than others and no it ain't nothing new in the food and it makes sense why they would preach that because medication is, is their business so um so i kept doing research man and i started to study this human body and how this thing work and i realized like the way god made this thing what you put in you will come out you understand what i'm saying and I started to notice that my body, which I'm sure a lot of people body don't, it just don't react well to dairy. Don't do it. I cut dairy out my diet and ta-da, you know. Uh, I could spend a, a heavy alcoholic beverage night. The next day, I'm either going to have a, I'm going to end up sweating it out. I'm, I might uh, urinate some of the alcohol out or I might throw it up. But whatever you put in you is going to come out. It's going to come out. And I... Uh, I figured if, if it works that way with food, it has to work that way with content. Like, it has to work that way. What you put in you will come out, even if it's content. And it took for me to, um, like, notice on YouTube. I would go on other people's YouTube to look up something, and I noticed, like, their YouTube front page would be something completely different than mine, or that person's, or, you know, this person might be heavy, basketball like LeBron scored 69 Blake Griffin whatever then this person might you know that 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 female who having in the fitness like her whole page just seemed to be all fitness and 10 tips to lose weight or whatever and I realized like YouTube has search engines that work like a brain it it, it, it finds out what you like based on your search history it finds out what you want to see and it just gives you more of it, you know? It gives you more of it. So I guess the question is why I'm so positive. If you was to look on my YouTube page, you would see a lot of like, you know, um, Will Smith interviews, Damon Dash interviews, Master P interviews, Jay-Z interviews, uh, Eric Thomas. Uh, you would see some Breakfast Club interviews. Um, You'll see a lot of Dave Chappelle, Kevin Hart, a lot of comedy. Just a lot of stuff that I try to feed myself with. And I realized, like, this is what I put in me, you know? I don't think I'm a king. I know I'm a king. But I eat a lot of king. I eat king for breakfast. I eat it for lunch. I study this. I study that. And I figured, like, man, it seemed like the more I learn, the more I want to teach. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just... And it's just, that's what it is, you know? And I always tell people, man, if you really wanna know who somebody really is, grab their phone and go through their Google search or log into YouTube with their account and just look at the stuff that come up. You know what I'm saying? If you're a negative person, just completely negative, I'm pretty sure you take in a lot of negativity. And like I say, it has to come out, which kind of made me think even further, like if YouTube, can give you more of what you want, why can't the world, you know? The world works the same way. It works the same way. That's why they say be careful who you hang with. Uh, even having some type of silly conversations, these silly conversations that keep reoccurring, dude, it's just the world know what you in it for. They, it, it knows, it just, that's how the universe works and it's just designed to give you more of what you looking for, period. So if you hating and you negative and you always complaining about something, nine times out of ten, I don't even want to get the name of specific things you might be watching, but 
uh, depending on how somebody act and how they carry themselves, I can guarantee you, if you give me five guesses, I will guess three of them things that they take in because I can clearly see it's coming up. So I avoid confrontation that way because I fully understand what it is. Like, oh, I know why you mad. If I put up something on social media and it just completely rub somebody and they just go overboard and I don't react, it's because I'm a step ahead of you. I, I know I'm not your problem. I know what's wrong with you. It's just it's just that clear, it's that evident. So I just want to tell people, man, just be cautious of what you put in you because it's gonna come out. It that's the only way it works. It has to come out. It has to. You let negativity in, negativity gonna come out. You let positivity in, positivity gonna come out, man. I love y'all.